Okay, everybody, listen up. Hey, you all got your new script, so hurry up and learn your lines. Hey, Terrier. Yeah. Hey, Terrier. Hey, psst. Hey, uh, my part's not big enough. Not big enough? No. Well, um, take Dawn's lines then. All right. <laughs> uh, uh, Toby, we got a big, big problem. Afghana won't come out of a dressing room. Holy chihuahua. Uh, you want me, boss? Oh, no, not you, Charlie. Well, what should I do? We're, we're on. We're on. Well, um, quick, run the promos for tonight's show while I try and talk. That's a good idea, boss. Roll it. Tonight on W-O-O-F. It's those crime-fighting canines, Starsky and Husky. Watch as the dognamic duo go after a ring of dog nappers, followed by Arsenio Hall. Woof, 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 woof. Join Arsenio and his guest tonight will be Barkara Streisound and Stevie Wonder Dog. Then stay tuned for the late Great Dane feature presentation of A Few Doggies More. I'm looking for the man who shot my paw. The epic western classic starring Clint Eastwolf. That's Starsky and Husky, followed by Arsenio. And then our late Great Dane showcase starring Clint Eastwolf. Tonight on W-O-O-F. All dog, all the time. Afghana, please come out. No. Pretty please? No. Pretty please with kibble on top? No, and there's nothing you can say that'll make me change my mind either. Well, I guess we'll just have to replace her then. Replace me? Not on your life, buddy. Out of my way. I've got a show to do. Ladies and Dobermans, welcome to W-O-O-F. Television that has gone the dog. Toby Terrier, he's on the air right now. Toby Terrier, with some serious bow wow wow. Toby Terrier, he's a hunting hound. Toby Terrier and his video pals. Roll over, over. This is Dog TV. We're glad you're here. The place you want to be. So fetch this little puppy, Neo Pooch, if you please. I'm talking about the canine saying, well, scratch my fleas. Toby Terrier. He's the happening hound. Toby Terrier. And his video pals. Toby Terrier. He's on the air right now. Toby Terrier. With some serious bow, wow, wow. <laughs> Hey, Toby Terrier, guess what? It's National Safety Day! Wow, I didn't know that. I was just reading in the newspaper they're having a special contest to pick the safest place to work. Toby, we could enter that contest. That is a great idea. You know, <sighs> this is a safe place to work. Uh -huh. uh, we could win that contest, no problem. Uh -huh. Wow, and we could do some television shows mm -hmm. about safety. Uh, Wow, now all we have to do is come up with some ideas. Ideas. Yeah. Ideas. Let's see. I we ideas. No. Ideas, ideas, see. ideas. Hmm. Ideas, no, ideas. Me. Toby, hmm. yeah. how do you usually come up with a good idea? Well, I'm not really sure. Usually they just kind of hit me. Wow! <laughs> wow! I see. Uh, I have an idea. <sighs> Speak to me, little buddy. Speak to me. <sighs> Toby, are you okay? Yeah, I think so. <sighs> My paw's a little sore, though. I didn't know you knew how to skateboard. I don't. Somebody hit me in the head with a basketball. Oh, uh, that would be me. A and then I tripped over a skateboard. Somebody uh, must have forgotten to put it away. Well, uh, that wasn't me, but I'm sorry I hit you with the basketball. I was aiming for the basket, and I missed. But I'll be more careful next time. Well, yeah. well, Reed, whose name is on it? Uh, oh, let's see here. Property of. I don't know anybody named of. Hey, Don. Read the next line. Property of, <laughs> of, of Charlie. Oh, Charlie. Oh, no. I'm in trouble. 
I better hide. It belongs to Charlie. I better find him. Charlie! Charlie! Huh, it's Charlie's skateboard. I should talk to him about putting his things away. Mm -hmm. Hey, let's start getting our new safety shows ready. We better be more careful around here. You're right, because the judge for that safety contest will be here real soon. Well, let's get to work. All right. Yeah. Okay. Oh, 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 excuse oh, me. Let's oh, go this yeah. way. Right. Yeah. Safety. I forgot. Yeah. <sighs> Hi. I am not a professional actress. I'm a real dog, just like you. Oh. Oh. Yo, baby. Yo. When my husband comes home from work, his fur is dirty and smells like a kennel. You know what I mean. That's why I use new Bones bleach. Ah, uh, honey, my fur smells so fresh. Thanks. And thank you, Bones Bleach. Bones Bleach gets the spot out of spot. Hello, I'm Toby Terrier, and welcome to another episode of Emergency K911. Today, we present a special episode What to Do in Case of an Emergency. Let's watch what two ordinary dogs. Ordinary? Watch it, buddy. Uh, let's watch what two. Not so ordinary dogs do in case of an emergency. Well, before an emergency happens, we should panic. Ah! No! We should plan an escape route. If there's a fire, we can get out through the door. Or if it's blocked, we can get out through the window. Mm -hmm. There's no fire here. Oh, there's the smoke alarm. First of all, we should panic. Ah! No! No, no, no. We should never panic. Oh. We should follow the emergency escape route out of the house. Hmm. Hmm. Wait a minute. You're forgetting something. I know. Panic! Ah! No, 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 no. We're forgetting we should stay down low. Uh, right. Yeah. There's more air down there. Yes. Wait a minute. Now what? You're forgetting one more thing. Panic! Ah! No, I know. Don't open the door unless you feel it first to see that it's not hot. Got that? Right. And then we panic? No. Oh. Then we calmly leave. We'll panic outside. <laughs> yes, good job. And when you get out of the house, don't go back in. And when your family is out of your home, count heads to make sure everyone is out of the house, okay? Okay. One, two. We're all here. Good job. Remember, don't hide under furniture or in your closets. It makes it hard for the firefighters to find you. Got it? Got it. And when you're out of the house and everyone is safe, call the fire department. Got that? Got it. And do you know what to do if the fire actually touches you? Oh, I know, I know, I know. And don't say panic. No, 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 no. This time I really know. When you're hot under the collar and you feel a little heat Don't try to run away, just get down on the feet And stop, drop, and roll over Stop, drop, and roll over, over Stop, drop, and roll over Hey, that's the way to get cool When you smell something burning and you don't think it's dinner Better do what I do if you wanna be a winner Stop, drop, and roll over And the old food bowl Just get down on the floor And start to rock and roll Stop, drop, and roll over Stop, drop, and roll over, over Stop, drop, and roll over Hey, that's the way to keep cool Be cool, guys We interrupt this program For a test of the emergency canine unit Remember, this is only a test. Hey! Turn that thing off! Did you say something, boss? Yeah, I said turn that thing off! 
What? Turn that thing off! Just a second. I can't hear you. Let me turn this thing off. Now, what did you say? Never mind. <clears throat> okay, test's over and you all pass. And now, it's time for the Home Barking Network. Here's your host, Bob Barkley. Hi, friends. Boy, do we have some terrific items for you to bark at today. Let's see what's up first. Why, it's the mailman! <laughs> Next we have... A cat! Ooh! <laughs> hey, what's that I hear? Why, it's the doorbell! Somebody's at the door! <laughs> well, that's all the time we have for this time. So until next time, keep on barking! <laughs> hey, uh, boss, I'm gonna have some milk. You want some? Sure. How about you, Billy? Uh, no thanks. I just had a couple of bowls of water. I'm gonna go to the green room. Excuse me. Well, suit yourself. <laughs> I like chocolate powder in mine. How about you? Oh, sure. Wait a minute, Don! What? That's not chocolate powder. That's cleanser! Oops. Well, I guess you don't want any in your milk then, huh? Uh, of course not. This shouldn't even be here. Cleaning supplies should be locked up. Well, I'll take care of it right away, Toby. Oh, good. <sighs> hey, Afghana, have you seen Charlie anywhere? No. Oh, but wait, um, er, uh, so many colors in the hey, world. Hey, Bob, hmm. uh, have you seen Charlie? Not my day to watch him, pal. Ha, ha, ha. Shh. Gee, I wonder where he is. I'm in really big, big trouble. I can't let them find me. Uh... Whoa, Billy, uh, Billy, be careful. Uh, Billy, whoa. Ah! Billy, uh, are you okay? Of course I'm okay. I have all my appropriate safety gear on. I have my helmet, my elbow pads, and my knee pads. Boy, if we're all careful like that, we'll win the contest paws down. <laughs> You're not kidding. All right. Hey, Don, you should keep trying to find Charlie. And Bob, you should get ready. Classics Theater is next. Okay, I'm on my way. All right, let's see you go. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Be careful. Whoa! Be careful. Safety first. Whoa! You betcha safety first. Whoa! <laughs> I love that guy. Greetings. Welcome to another edition of Classics Theater on W-O-O-F. Today's special presentation is Little Red Riding Hound. When last we left Little Red Riding Hound, she was about to go to her grandmother's for a visit. And now, Little Red Riding Hound. <laughs> oh, hi. I'm Little Red Riding Hound, and I'm going to Grandmother's house. Red Riding Hound? Hmm. I already told them that. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> Over the river and through the woods To grandmother's house we go A shortcut I'll take Cause there's cookies and cake I'm a hungry girl, don't you know? Mm -hmm. Over the river and through the woods Oh, how the wind does blow Hope grandma has heat and something to eat Oh, right back to mother I go Grandmother's house I go I'm looking both ways Cause I tell you these days There's wolves everywhere Don't you know <laughs> Help! Ah! Uh, 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 who are you? I'm the forest crossing guard Phew I thought you were the uh, uh, There are crossing guards in the forest? Well in this forest there are Hey where are you going? Mm, I'm going to my grandmother's house. Uh, and you were going to cross the street? Mm-hmm. Aha! Ah! Miss, uh... Little Red Riding Hound, thank you very much. Wow, that's a mouthful. Mm -hmm. uh, how about if I just call you Red? 
Okay. Look here, Red. Uh, there are rules for how you have to cross the street. But, but, we're in the middle of the forest. Yeah, but these rules are for everywhere. Everywhere? Yep, everywhere. First oh. of all, you have to cross the street at the light. The light? What yeah. light? That light. A traffic light? In the middle of the forest? When the light is red, it means don't walk. Red light, don't walk. Got it. And when it turns green, then you can walk. Oh, okay. Green light, I can walk. Got it. <laughs> Not so fast! Ah, what? But, but I understand now. Red light, stop. Uh, green light, go. What's so hard about that? Well, that's only part of it. Hmm. You still need to look both ways. Like this. Look left. Mm -hmm. Look right. Mm -hmm. Look left. Mm -hmm. Got it? Uh, yeah, uh, look left, look right, and left. Nobody's coming. <laughs> Not so fast! <laughs> what, 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 what? You what? still forgot one more very important rule. <gasps> Another one? I waited for the green light. I, I looked both ways. What now? Always listen for the traffic, too. And always cross the street with a grown-up. Hmm, okay. So now you know all the rules. I'll leave now. And don't forget, uh, I know, uh, cross at the green light, look both ways, listen, and cross with a grown-up. Hmm. I'll be watching. Okay. Thanks. Okay, um, I'm at the light. Uh, I look left, look right, I look left, hmm. listen. Uh, wait, no grown-up. Uh, how am I supposed to cross the street uh, without a grown-up? Help! Help! Mr. Crossing Guard, come back! Where am I going to find a grown-up in the middle of the forest? Help! Will Little Red Riding Hound find a grown-up? Uh, I don't know. Will she ever cross the street? Uh, hey, Mr. Announcer, um, how old are you? Uh, are you a grown-up? Hmm? Will she make it to her grandmother's house? Uh. We'll find out later today when the Classics Theatre presentation of Little Red Riding Hound continues. For now, this is Bob Barkley for Classics Theatre on W-O-O-F for Day. Hi, I'm Don Dane. Do you ever forget the names of people you've just met? Do you sometimes forget what you are talking about? Do you ever forget the names of people you've just met? You should try the Don Dane School of Memory. My proven method of memory is based on two simple principles. First, we can remember if... Uh, if we... Hmm. Okay, skip the first one. But second, we remember what we want to remember. And third... No, wait a minute. <clears throat> My proven method of memory improvement is based on three simple principles. Number one, I'll come back to. Number two, we remember what we want to. And number three, no, three is we remember what we want to. Well, anyway, if you buy my course, you'll never again forget how to spell a new word, or what time you're supposed to be somewhere, or where you left your bowling ball. Where did I leave my bowling ball? Well... So call now to order my two audio tapes for only $19.99. Think of it, for only $14.99, you get six full-length tapes teaching you everything you need to know about farming. Uh, memory. Quite a deal. Ten tapes for only six dollars. So call now. 555-2341? 5423... Five, what? No, no, that's not it. Let me think. Five 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 five. No, no. Oh yes, five 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 one two three four. That's five 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 three four two one. Write it down now if you have to. But I promise you, after listening to my tapes, you'll never remember where you left your pencil again. Hey, nice work, guys. You're really keeping the safety theme going well. Ralph! <laughs> I like candy, yes I do, less I do. Hey, Toby, look what I found. What is it? I think it's candy. You want some? 
That's not candy, Billy. That's medicine. Uh, that should be locked up out of the way. I'll lock this stuff up. Oh, good. Yeah. Hey, don't run in the studio. <laughs> oh, uh, right. Uh, safety. <laughs> right. Oh, I almost forgot. I gotta go lock this stuff up. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll lock it up so it's safe. Nobody will take it. And now, it's time for every dog's favorite music and dance show, American Bark Stand. American. And now, a command performance on American Bark Stand, the king of rock and roll over, Elk Hound. You've been outside playing your muddy, muddy thing. When you get out of the bathroom, you are soaking wet. Now your mama's gonna whimper, your daddy's gonna howl. Slowly start to wail Well, you eat a little kibble And do a little growl Before you go to sleep Better howl a little howl Shake, shake, keep shaking Don't fake, keep shaking Shake, shake, keep shaking Shake it all the water off your fuzzy fur Hey, I never beg I'd rather be alone Headed to the backyard Start digging for a bone Well, I've been outside to play And I'm muddy and I'm dirty I'll come right home and take a bath And come out really pretty Shake, shake, keep shaking Don't fake, keep shaking Shake, shake, keep shaking Water off your fuzzy fur. Shake it. Hey, where's Charlie? Uh, I don't know, Toby. As soon as he got off stage, I think he went off hiding again. Hmm. Well, I hope he doesn't think that I'm angry with him. You're not angry with him? Well, of course not. He's not angry at me? Accidents happen, but I would like to talk to him about how we can be more careful. Yeah. Now, pass me the microphone. Okay. Don, Bernice, places for part two of Little Red Riding Hound. Thanks, Billy. Oh, Jared. Hey, don't run in the studio! Yeah, hey, hey, slow down! I want to win this contest! Yeah. Yeah. Welcome back to Classics Theater. We now present the conclusion of Little Red Riding Hound. When last we saw Little Red, she was stuck at the street corner, waiting for a grown-up to help her across the street. Let's see if she made it. Ha! <laughs> ah, I made it. But if it weren't for that nice prince who was on his way to rescue that Rapunzel person, I'd still be stranded there. <laughs> ah! Hi there. I'm the big bad wolf, and I'm here to huff and puff and blow your house down. That's not the right story, is it? I didn't think so. You're supposed to be waiting for me at my grandmother's house. Oh, gee, I'm sorry. I was stuck on the corner for an hour waiting for a grown-up to help me cross the street. <gasps> you too, huh? Yeah. Hmm. Well, let's get back to the story, okay? Yeah, let's see. Where were we? Oh, I remember. Hmm. Hi, I'm your grandma. Hmm. <clears throat> hey, hey, wait, wait, wait. Where are you going? Well, I'm walking away. You're a stranger, and I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. No, no, you're supposed to say, Grandma, what big ears you have, and stuff like that. Uh, no, I don't talk to strangers. Bye! Oh, wait, 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 C can mm. I give you a lift to Grandma's house? I have a scooter over there behind that hollow tree. Uh, no, I'm not supposed to go anywhere with strangers. I'll walk. Hm. Piece of candy? Candy? No, thanks. I never take candy I from know, strangers. I know, I know, I know. No candy from strangers. You Fine. got it. Bye, stranger. Sheesh. <laughs> uh, hey.
Hey, Red Riding Hood, uh, come out and play. Who is it? Uh, it's, uh, <clears throat> it's, uh, your friend. Hmm, which friend? Oh, uh, it's, uh, it's Rapunzel. Oh, uh, hmm. yeah, oh, that's it. Yeah, yeah, it's Rapunzel. Yeah, I just washed my hair and, uh, I can't do a thing with it. Hmm. Well, wait a minute. You can't be Rapunzel, because she's trapped in the highest tower in all the land. Everybody knows that. Nice try. Ah, she ruined the whole thing. I was supposed to say, the better to hear you with. And then she'd say, what big teeth you have. And I'd say, the better to floss with. And then... <laughs> you forgot to look both ways, stranger. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> and that is the end of Little Red Riding Hound, or as close as we could get. For now, this is Bob Barkley for Classics Theatre on W-O-O-F. Good day. Hey, Toby. Hey, Toby. Uh, uh, Toby, uh, were you looking for me? Yeah, hey, we found your skateboard. Oh, uh, I'm really sorry about that. Yeah, it's okay. Try not to let it happen again, okay? Oh, well, um, how do I do that? Well, the key word is safety. Hmm. Hey, Toby, the judge for the safety contest is here. Oh, hi, I I'm Toby Terrier. Uh, how we do? Congratulations, Mr. Terrier. I've inspected the whole studio, and you've won the contest. This is a very safe place to work. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, that's just great. That I terrific is great. right. Thanks a lot. I'll be right back with your trophy. Yo, hey, Toby, tell me what is the best. Don't play with bottles in your medicine chest. And don't play with sockets or touch a loose wire. But is it okay to put my hand in a fire? I don't think so. Uh-uh-uh. Oh, no. When I cross the street, I'm gonna look both ways. Gonna ask a grown-up where it's safe to play. When I see cleaning products, gonna leave them alone. When I'm not sure, I better ask a person who's grown. Great idea. Yes. Okay. Terrific. Should I look both ways before I cross the street? Yes. Oh. Should I talk to strangers that I happen to meet? Oh, no! Should I take a piece of candy if it's offered to me? Uh, uh, uh! Oh. Should I play with the knives in the kitchen I see? Oh, no! Gotta be careful, you gotta watch out. This puppy knows what he's talking about. There's rules of safety, you better bone up. And if you're not quite sure, puppy, ask a grown-up. Great idea! Sure! Terrific! Good job! It is with great pleasure that I award to you all! Oh. Hey, whose roller skate is that? Well, uh, says here, property of Toby Terrier. <laughs> Whoops. Does this mean we don't get to keep the trophy? <laughs> Toby Terrier here! Hey, remember to talk to your family about the things that you can do to make your home a safe place to live. Just remember, safety first! I'll see you soon! Uh, right you are! <laughs> oh, I love you too! <laughs> Goodbye!
interactive fun goes on and on in each all new adventure of Toby Terrier and his video pals. You'll rock with laughter when a rock and roll star visits WOOF in singing and dancing and wagging our tails. National Tea Day! Uh, and when Toby and his pals enter a safety contest, everything at WOOF goes hilariously out of control in Safety First. Yo, hey Toby, tell me what is the best? Don't play with bottles in your medicine chest. And don't play with sockets or touch a loose wire. But is it okay to put my hand in a fire? I don't think so, uh-uh. In Time for a Party, you'll join the video pals at Afghanistan's costume party, where games are only part of the fun. Look out! Whoa! Whoa! And explore the funny side of health and fitness with WOOF in Is There a Dog Tour in the House? Ouch! I hurt myself. Is there a dog tour here? Oh, no you don't. You're not fooling me. I'm not going to any of that. Every episode of Toby Terrier and his video pals lets you laugh, play, and sing along. But the one little duck with the feather on his back, he led the others with his quack, quack, honk, quack, quack, honk, quack, quack, honk. He led the others with his quack, quack, honk. When you're watching TV with Toby, you're a part of his show. Watch the fun on screen and off as your Toby puppy gets into the act too. Look for all the wonderful video adventures of Toby Terrier and his video pals where toys are sold. What's a brick? <laughs> Toby Terrier! With some serious bow wow.